good Monday morning, everyone. I'm SWKSS Chief Damon Latham, and this is a weather update for today. Uh, again, Monday, October 30th, 2023. Going over our weather rundown for today, uh, the rain will be ending and clearing west to east today, slowly clearing across the region uh, as we move through uh, the afternoon hours. Freeze watch has been issued for our Kentucky counties. We'll go over that as well as tracking that first freeze for the 2023-2024 season. The National Weather Service Forecast Office in Paducah has issued that freeze watch. That's for, well, if you live in West Kentucky, period, you're under it. Uh, Tennessee County's National Weather Service out of Nashville has not included you in a freeze watch or anything just yet. If they do do that, we will do a text update on the page to update everyone of that. Uh, so we are watching for it. Uh, that's in effect for our Kentucky counties from Monday evening through Tuesday morning. Uh, temperatures dropping into the upper 20s. Uh, impacts of frost and freeze conditions could kill crops and sensitive vegetation and possibly damage unprotected outdoor plumbing. Uh, take steps to protect uh, tender plants from the cold. Uh, prevent freezing a possible bursting of outdoor pipes. They should be wrapped, drained, and allowed to drip slowly. Uh, hopefully you've done that already. Uh, go ahead and take a look at our five-day weather forecast. Today, a 40% chance of showers. That mainly in the morning, uh, mainly in our eastern counties. Uh, we should already be clearing out uh, first thing in the morning to the west. Uh, far west Kentucky in our region and clearing slowly through the day. Uh, so that 40% chance of showers again, mainly for our western counties uh, of our, our eastern counties of our area until 10 a.m. Then cloudy, uh, gradual clearing, uh, the high of 46 tonight, widespread frost, mainly after 10 p.m., otherwise clear with a low of 26 degrees. Uh, with that freeze watch in effect. Tuesday, Halloween, widespread frost before 10 a.m., otherwise sunny with a high of only 46 degrees, northwest wind of 5 to 11 miles an hour with gusts as high as 18 miles an hour. That's going to bring our wind shields on down uh, as well. Tuesday night, Halloween night, uh, widespread frost after 3 a.m., otherwise mostly clear with a low of just 25 degrees, northwest wind at 8 to 11 miles an hour, with guess as high is 18 miles an hour. Uh, that's going to be dropping our windshields into the teens Halloween night. Uh, so make sure you have the kiddos uh, wrapped up as you head out to do that trick-or-treating and other events on Tuesday evening. Wednesday, widespread frost again before 10 a.m., and then otherwise sunny with a high of only 46 degrees, Wednesday night, mostly clear with a low of 29. Thursday, sunny. We hit 56 degrees. We're going to feel like we hit a heat wave there. Uh, Thursday night, uh, mostly clear with a low of 34. Friday, sunny with a high of 61 degrees. Looks like a great day on Friday. And looking ahead to your weekend, we get back up into the mid-60s once again. And that's all we have for your weather update for today. We'll do another weather update first thing in the morning. They will include an hour-by-hour -hour forecast for your trick-or-treating activities for Halloween. Thanks for watching, everyone. Stay safe and have a great day.